YouTube, I said I wouldn't do any more hair and makeup uh, vlogs because uh, there are too many of those already, but I have been wanting to take a little walk on the wild side. Yep, I am dyeing my hair lavender. Uh, it's something I've always wanted to do. I almost took a look at uh, some other products, but I would have had to uh, bleach my hair first and then uh, put that uh, color on later, but there was a very pretty pastel pink I was looking at buying, or there was a, a silvery blue I was also really interested in because I have such a lighter complexion. And that's why I went for the Splat Lavender because um, it has a bleaching kit in it and uh, it's like, like a light color, so. I'm gonna be doing that tonight. Hello world, I'm Maya Sendermeyer and I would like to welcome you to the latest episode of my vlog series. So far I have been able to share my experiences on what it's like to live on the autistic spectrum or rather have Asperger syndrome. A second thing that I will do is provide uh, my two cents on uh, what's going on with autism in the media. And a third area entails uh, providing tips and advice for those of you who are on the spectrum. I will also reach out to your friends, family members, peers, mentors, educators, employers, and anybody who is inside the autistic community. And finally, I will cover topics on things that I'm passionate about, along with sharing the day in the life of Maya Sendermeyer. So check it out. I have got uh, my uh, bleaching uh, solution in my hair at the moment, and there's a few things I wanted to mention. Number one, of course, uh, the, the chemicals are itchy on my skin, and I can't wait to wash this out. And two, I haven't dyed my hair uh, blonde in so long. I used to dye it that, this color all the time, uh, and I've never ever dyed my hair purple or dyed it green or anything. This is my first time doing a lavender look, uh, but uh, I'm perfectly fine uh, with the color blonde for future. Uh, and I know I'm not going to buy this kit again because number one, uh, ow, 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 ow. it makes a huge mess. I mean, the bleaching kit, the powdery stuff, and it just I kept getting on my counter here in the bathroom, and it was you know, so that's why it's a pain in the. the and then um, I think I could do well without all these wild colors this is just one of those once-in-a-lifetime things and I say I'll call this my um, my per um, uh, hair dyeing experiment I just got out of the shower and I, I am finished with round one of hair dyeing uh, in the meantime I'm gonna let my hair dry completely That's why I've got this on and uh, I'm gonna drink a kombucha um, going to be really really interesting to see my hair in a purpley lavender I just hope I don't make a huge mess but uh, my hair is not you know bleach blonde I mean it's blonde but it has a, an orange hint to it so here it is right currently my hair is blonde I thought that I would be able to like this look I don't like this at all it's just um, it's a little bit too much for me as far as I'm concerned, but uh, um, I look too, uh, I don't know what's the word. I look too much, uh, I look too punkish with this look. <laughs> Check this out. Get over here, don't, don't argue with me. Look it, we match, we match, AJ. At the moment, AJ and I match color. So, I was trying to get to AJ to pose for a picture since our hair matches right now, but that's not possible. Um, I don't know what I look like, but I guess I look, at the moment I look like freaking Justin Bieber, which is what I don't like. I just, I hate this, uh, this orangey color. Um, but in a few minutes, round two goes in. Uh, I just hope and pray my uh, skin doesn't turn purple or I'll be uh, the one-eyed, one-eyed, one-eyed purple 
people eater. One eyed, one eyed, one eyed purple people eater. So here is the look. Uh, this did not turn out the way I wanted it. It is not the beautiful uh, lavender that I've seen other girls wear. This is like a fuchsia with white in it. Um, I absolutely hate the bleach look. I mean, it's pretty and everything, but it's a little bit much being uh, that I've never had my hair a different color other than like a brick red. But um, I, I've uh, contemplated I'm going to be wearing it to work, and if my colleagues are going to say no to it, I'm going to go and get me some uh, hair color remover, and uh, that'll be the end of that. But. I don't really like this very much. Uh, I mean, it's fun, but it's just, I'm not sure if my colleagues are gonna go for it, so. Never mind. I um, got a little trim and worked it a little bit. Um, I used a little bit of this got to be, um, which is uh, glued. Uh, it's called spiking glue and uh, it just, uh, this makes my hair, I mean, it didn't, yes, it didn't turn out the way I wanted it to, but this makes uh, colored hair uh, on a 36 year old look a little more unique. Um, so I was hoping to be more of a lavender so I could be the whole purple tuna fish that I always say to people when they ask me, are you okay or not? But um, specifically though, I could, I mean, I don't go and dye my hair different colors. What? I mean, my, uh, my Alexa has been, I'm having prolonged delays, I've been having problems with, like, with her lately, but, uh, did that literally come on? So there it goes, um, but... That's the song, This Is A Part Of Me, but specifically, I am not, I think uh, one of the statements I'm trying to make with a purple tuna fish, and right now with this uh, pink, this bubblegum pink hair, um, and with the blonde highlights, or the blonde underneath, is that uh, I want people to know that I'm just a normal person like everybody else, but I, uh, I want to mention that maybe this uh, pink hair represents part of my autism and maybe that's what I'm trying to portray. 